A peaceful demonstration tonight on the streets of Royal Oak. Dozens of people showed up to protest President-elect Donald Trump. Our Mara McDonald live tonight. Mara, uh, we did not see the violence that we've seen in other cities. No, Devin, not at all. This was simply a peaceful protest where people got to voice their anger. Take a look. We reject white supremacy. They chanted and they marched through the streets of Royal Oak tonight. We do not respect the president-elect. With homemade signs and either anger or sadness over the outcome of the election. It breaks my heart as a historian and it breaks my heart as a human being to, um, to see what has happened and what is happening to minorities, to people who are LGBTQ, to Muslim, to non-Christians. Um, that is why I'm here tonight. Plenty of speeches. How do I help? And chanting as the group headed down Washington Avenue. Well, I mean, like, I just think it's important to just, like, get the message across. Like, people are not making this up. He's referencing a group of students at Royal Oak Middle School caught on camera shouting, build the wall. It went viral on social media. Tonight's protest was in direct response to that. Well, been in mourning for a few days. You know, I can, I'm going to start crying. <laughs> It's, it's, it's just horrifying. I'm almost 62 years old, you know, like, and, and it's, I, I just, I've never seen anything like this. Back here live, protesters had plenty of cars honking in support to them, but they also had plenty of hecklers, too. Meanwhile, in downtown Detroit, we had a third night of anti-Trump protests. We are live in Royal Oak tonight. I'm Mara McDonald, and for one more time on the 11, Carmen, back to you. All right. Thank you, Mara.